Hey everyone, it's Scott, and this is Blessings and Ball Cards EP6. Let's get active, everybody. Kids, parents, and grandparents, it's time to get our bodies moving. While the intro runs, I want you to do squats. Yeah, I don't like them either, but your body is a gift from God and we have to take care of it. Okay, everyone, keep your weight back and your bottom low because here comes the intro. How many did you do? I really appreciate all the comments you're leaving for your activity. That's really encouraging to see. And always remember commandment number nine. Yeah, don't lie. This is our special Memorial Day episode where we give our love, thanks, and respect to the nearly 650,000 men and women that have lost their lives serving the USA since the Revolutionary War and another 550,000 that have passed away from non-combat related issues. I hope this channel is reaching folks outside of the U.S. as well. If this is you, I pray that you have comfort and healing for those that have served your country in the name of God. Listen up, friends. We have a stellar episode today. We will pray for the men and women in our armed forces, as well as those that have lost loved ones that have served. Then to the card table, where we're going to rip some special baseball packs. Just like any other red, white, and blue related episode, we have to open baseball cards because, duh, it's America's pastime. There is some old school flair to these openings. Any collectors of the 90s remember these little guys? Yeah, starting lineup figures. If you have one, please leave a comment below and let me know your favorite. The boys will open the 2020 Topps Big League Baseball Hobby Box, which includes a 7-inch figure. The nostalgia of the 90s meets 2021. Should be a good time. From the card table, We'll move on to our Bible lesson about sacrifice. We will learn how we can sacrifice our selfishness for the glory of God. And a big blessings alert. We will share some great news about how your generosity is working for God's glory through the support of this channel. Okay, say it with me. Philippians chapter 2 verse 3 says, Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit. Rather, in humility, value others above yourselves. Now please, bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. Heavenly Father, you are all-knowing, all-powerful, and ever-present with us, and we love you for your incredible grace, mercy, and love. Spirit, please provide comfort and healing to the men and women that have served our country in your name. May they know that your love will provide them comfort in their time of need. Please extend your loving hand over those that are currently serving in our armed forces and keep them safe. You, Lord, have conquered Satan, sin, death, and hell, and because of this we owe everything to you. Jesus, you are our memorial, our true savior every day. Thank you for your daily blessings. We will take nothing for granted and know that you are in charge of every moment. Please be patient with us, Lord, as we strive to confess our sins, to take care of others, and to be the hands and feet of Jesus. Together, all of God's children said, amen. Please leave prayer requests in the comments or email us using the about link on our YouTube channel page. The Bible tells us that there is power in prayer, especially in groups. Together, we will work to be closer to the glory of God through prayer and devotion. Just a reminder to visit our eBay store to view and purchase some of the ball cards that we pull in our packs. Also, please remember to check out our merch site, which is hosted by Bonfire.com. There's some really cool stuff out there, which helps support this channel. But I am sorry, there are no really sweet floral print shirts like this one. But still, some great things to look at. I'll tell you what, I'm so excited to see what those figures look like and see what kind of cards are in those packs. So let's not wait any longer, and let's go to the card table. Alright guys, welcome to the card table. We do have the Topps Big League Baseball 2020 Hobby Box to open today. And it's really cool because if any of you 90s kids remember the starting lineups figures, these actually have a very similar figurine included with them. I'm not quite sure what it looks like, but let's rip it open and see what, see what it does look like. Ooh, what is it right away? Is it Cody Bellinger? A Clayton Kershaw. Clayton Kershaw. 
Well, that's really cool. It comes with a big card. I guess the figure is about the same size as the old starting lineups figures. Although it can actually move his legs. Yep, this arms. one comes with a big card. Is there anything on the back of it? All right, collect them all. Buster Top Posey, Ho Jose Altuve, Cody Bellinger, Aaron Judge. Wait, so it looks it? like there's five figures that come with the set. And Cohen pulled out the Clayton Kershaw. <clears throat> I kind of wish I pulled out Aaron Judge or Buster Posey or Cody Bellinger. <laughs> okay. But I still am really happy. Let's though. go ahead and rip those packs open and see what those cards look like. Okay, here comes the first pack. Whip leaders, 2019, 2019 National League. What are people here? Jacob DeGrom is the only person I know. Okay, there are 10 cards per pack, and it looks like there are five packs per box. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> That's cool. Yep. Great, okay, so I think he hit a home run. George Solar. Yeah, that's cool. Pete Alonso. I don't have to put them in the is, is this an actual person? Yeah. That's Chapman. Chapman. That's a cool one. So we do have some pretty cool cards in here. Yeah, this is a different. I Gavin Lux rookie card. This is a pair. Trevor Story! This is a 14 out of 50. Oh, okay. So let's show, let's show everybody that card. This is a serial number card. As you can see here is the Trevor Story, and if you could see in the bottom right hand corner, it does say it's numbered 40 or 14, 14 out of 50 cards. <clears throat> so if you're unfamiliar with these, that means there's only 50 cards like this that exist. So this is the 14th one that was printed. Mm -hmm. Good pull. And the George Springer. How we can trick it, I don't know nothing. And back to the whip leaders. Okay. I'm really happy about this sort of story. <clears throat> okay. Back number two. I think every single one has one of these in the front. Here are yours. It's ERA. Uh, Garrett Cole, Justin Vero, and, and Charlie Morton. Don't really know Charlie Morton, but I know everybody else. That's okay. I don't even know how to say his name. I know not him. This is him. Ronald Acuna Jr. Wait, see, like, that's a cool card. Andrew McCutcheon. Aaron Hicks. I thought it was going to be Aaron Johnson. I'm <laughs> so smart. Flipping out. <laughs> Looks like he just maybe just hit a home run, and maybe that's a bat flip. Another Jack. Wow. That's cool. Don't know how to say his name. Oh, yeah. oh look at that card. That's cool. I think he's going to rob home run. Yeah, these these um, cards have some <clears throat> great photos on them. <clears throat> no, what is this? Ramon Laureano. That's hard to say. Answer Alberto. Answer Alberto. And back to that. Okay. That's also a good pack. I, I want to see another number card. Yeah. Um, I think that's my first, like, I think that's my closest card. Um, I'm to explain. But, like, <clears throat> for the number card, I think that's always I ever got. Yeah. Rafe Devers? Don't know. Hit leaders. Who are these people? Ozzy Abels, Kittle Marte, no one or not, I know all of those. That's cool. Oh, Wilson Contreras. Yeah, cool, this is pack number three. Shane Bieber, award winner. If that was number, I'll be so happy. This is going to be really John Buster. I know, I still want to. Charlie Morton. Buster Bosey. <laughs> And that's cool because he's on Giants and has an orange outline. Yeah, that and is that, cool. And that's just a pair of he didn't read. Oh, that's cool too. Oh. That's kind of... It's like a fat head card. <laughs> Look at his big head. <laughs> Gary Sanchez. Austin Riley, don't really know. And I think that's Ed. Okay. That was also a good one. I like the big head one. Finally. 
Lily Adams. I don't know him, but it's kind of cool. Let me show you too. The Angels highlights. Paulie John. John. <laughs> That's a fun name to say. Holy John. <laughs> this is Cody Bellinger, I know that. Pete Alonso and I do not know how to say that. Yeah. There you go, you can match your figurine right there. Scott Kingry, he was a future stars. And that's a cool one. Yeah, that is a cool and one. Defensive things. wizards. Your name's Scott. Amazing. <clears throat> Don't know him. You say Eduardo Rodriguez. It's hard to read. Another uh, no, Scott Kingery on the same one. Cool. On my trail. Ooh. Lorenzo King, back to the end. Da 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 da. Corey Gruber. Justin Verlander, another highlights. He's pretty excited. About Nick Senzel. Walk leaders. Oh, hey, Mike Trout. Him? Yes, Mike Trout. Pick with best. Mike Trout. 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 Is this like Spanish? <laughs> it looks like it. Maybe. It's a cool card though. Nick Solik. Don't know him. Is this Jordi Palanik? Gregory Palanco? Yeah. I'm not even close. <laughs> Chris Curtis Granderson. I haven't seen that fellow. At in first a while. I thought this was Granderson. <laughs> 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 Jack Flaherty. I cannot get that in the part. Okay. Great cards. All right, back at it. Griffin's up to bat now, so let's see what he's gonna get out of his box. What figurine do you think he's gonna get? We'll I find out here in just a few Aaron seconds. Judge. Oh, it's covered up. That's a Mystery. Oh. Who is it? Wow! It's another oh, Clayton Kershaw. Oh, it's another Clayton Kershaw. No. <laughs> okay, so the surprise is over. Both boys get Clayton Kershaw. <laughs> Anybody out there like Clayton Kershaw? Love to see that figurine. Wish they would have got two of them. Go ahead and let us know. Here we go. Pack number one. Jack Morris just fell over. Hang in there, Jack. We're Almost done. Players. Jack Flaherty, Jacob Degrom, and I'm not even gonna try pronouncing his name. Brandon Crawford, DJ LeMayhew, Trent Grisham, Grish, um, don't know, Walker Buller, Shin Su Chu. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Manny Machado. There oh, we go. Uh, Jordan Ooh, okay. Alvarez designated. That could be a good, that's a good rookie card there. I want to see if you can get that card like I did. AJ Bob. and Michael Franco. Okay, pack number one is done. We're moving on to pack number two. Charlie Blackman. Arrow leaders or ERA leaders. Garrett Cole, Justin Rowlander, and Charlie Morton. Eduardo Escobar. Freddie Galvis, Storm Base Leaders, Malik Smith, Adalberto Mondesi, and Jonathan Villar. But David Peralta, Defensive Wizards. A Clayton Kershaw Orange. A hey, there we go. Yes. An Aaron. Marcus Simeon, and that's it. Okay. We're rolling on into pack three now. Is 
Griffin's ripping and rolling. Raphael Devers. Hits leaders, Ozzy Alves, Kel Marte, and Nolan Arenado. Oscar Mercado, Daniel Murphy, saves leaders, Kirby Yates, Josh Hader, Will Smith. Kettle Marte, Nelson Cruz, Hunter Harvey, Jordan Montgomery, and Maggie. Awesome, good pack. Maybe boy. boy. Yeah. Pack number four, here we go. Wilson Contreras, Lily Adams, the Angels Highlights, Mitch Haniger, Salvador Perez, Harold R Ramirez, Boba Shet Highlights, Wilson Contreras, flipping out. Yep, there's a bat flip. Wilson Contreras. Yep. Jacob DeGrom. Rich Garfield. Pack number five. Paul Dijon, Corey Kluber, Justin Verlander highlights, Duel Lugo, Kettle Marte, Roll Call, Max Muncy, Nick Senzel, Shohei Otani. That's a good one. Jesus Angular, Gail Sano, and that's it. All right, cool cards. Hey guys, those have some um, really cool feature cards in them with the big heads and then the bat flipping cards. Those are all really great and I um, hope you guys like them. Those are pretty cheap boxes as well. So um, look them up on eBay and um, yeah, see if you can get luckier than us and find more than a Clayton Kershaw. Mm -hmm. But thanks guys, you wanna go ahead and throw us back? Back Griffin? to the desk. Another set of fun boxes and some great looking cards. The figures were fun to see even though we got doubles. The backs even had some great did you know information on them. For example, Hunter Harvey's card says, Hunter gets a homie to buzz the sides of his head so he can maintain his marvelous mullet. Thank you Tops for that valuable information. A mullet? What would that look like? <laughs> Thanks editing department for the assist. We did list some cards from this opening that will be available in our eBay store, so please check them out. The proceeds from our eBay store and our merch come back to this channel and we are committed to using half of that money to give back to others in need as we are called in Christ. In fact, here's the big blessing news I was talking about in the intro. We have raised $200 so far that we will be using to buy special meals and ball card packs for families of veterans in our area. Thank you to those that have bought from our eBay store and merch site. After only five episodes, your dollars are hard at work blessing others in Jesus' name. That is really exciting to see and all of the glory is God's. I appreciate and love you all for your help, faith, blessings, and prayers. Now it's time to move into our Bible lesson. In this episode, we're going to learn about sacrifice and what that means as a follower of Jesus. On this Memorial Day, we honor the many men and women that have sacrificed for our country to help protect us. Thank you so much for your service. And let's not forget, Jesus paid the ultimate sacrifice on the cross at Calvary to save us from Satan, sin, death, and hell. Sacrifice for Christ has many other levels outside of His death. Some examples of spiritual sacrifice that you can make include things like giving up items that you really want for yourself, you know, like ball cards, food, time, money, or even prayer. Do you only sacrifice these things if you get something in return? If so, then you aren't sacrificing anything except your faithfulness to God. That is worshiping yourself, not God. 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 7 says, Each one must give as he has decided in his heart, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. Kids and parents, myself definitely included, we need to be more unselfish and faithful to God by sacrificing the things that are really His gifts to us for His glory. When we sacrifice our time, money, personal items, prayer, or other gifts from God, we should do it in honor of the Father. 
not in honor of man. Because we are children of God, he delights in our faithful service. We can't expect to be Christ followers and live a comfortable life revolving around our needs and our comfort only. Please don't think that other people, organizations, and churches will care for those in need because it begins with you. In Hebrews chapter 13, verse 16, we can find a verse to sum up our sacrifice of prayer and love for others. It reads, Do not forget to do good and to share with others, for with such sacrifices God is pleased. We all enjoy when our parents are proud of the work we've done. Now imagine that in God's eyes. Our Heavenly Father would be pleased with our service to Him through the sacrifice of what are really His gifts, not ours. Sacrifice has to be done with joy and faithful service to God. With that said, I'd like to issue a challenge to both parents and kids. I want you to sacrifice something that you love, but do it with joy and in the name of Jesus. Be unselfish, be giving. Give to others instead of keeping it for yourself. You decide what it is that you want to sacrifice, but make it something that you love and it's hard to give up. Is it a pack of ball cards that you really want to rip open? Is it a double chocolate chip fudge brownie that you can't wait to sink your teeth into? Is it time maybe for you to sit and binge watch your favorite Netflix series? Is it having a certain amount of money in your wallet or bank account for your own financial security? Sacrificial giving means giving until it hurts. You can't give a pack of ball cards to your buddy's sister, you know, because technically she's a stranger and you don't really know her and hang out with her, and then have her give you the cards back so you can open it. That's unfaithful sacrifice. And because of that, she might give you cooties and then you'll need to get a cootie shot and it gets really complicated after that. Seriously though, give unselfishly until it hurts with abounding joy and you will be blessed in heaven for your service to our Lord. Blessing others brings you closer to God. Thank you for joining us today. The glory of this channel belongs to God. Thank you for spreading the word and sharing this channel so that we can spread His word. Please remember to check out our eBay store as well as our merch site for great BBC gear. The mug looks great. The shirt showed up really well. It's a great way to spread the word of the glory of God. We really appreciate your support for this channel so that we can support those in need. Please like and subscribe and turn that red subscribe button gray and enable notifications so you know when the next video is posted. Until our next video, God's blessings and always remember to love God and love people.